guys, welcome to part 77, and last episode, we killed Mirak. We're done. We're done, actually, now that I think about it, we're done with all the DLCs, except for Hearts Hearthstone, I, I don't remember what it's called, it's the one where you get to build a house, I've never messed with it, it doesn't provide any quests, it's literally just, build a house, and I'm not really that interested into that, so we're gonna probably ignore it. So now, what to do? I'm sorry, Serena. What is it? You have served me well, we have been good through friends. You have fought through two DLCs and done incredibly well, but I think it is time we part ways. Go have fun, go adventures of your own, live your life. Go live your life now that you have your own thing. Go have fun. You're staying with me, buddy boy, right, let's go. Because it's time to welcome Serena, not Serena, Lydia, back into the brawl. Lydia! Lydia! I am your sword and your shield. Good! Lead the way. Let's have we go on adventures again. By the way, I gotta get for you. I am at your command. You don't need that silly little steel sword anymore. Here's Tribrage. See? Let's get going. Oh, and this is Ro Rotor. Rotom. This is Rotom. <laughs> so I know you're wondering what quest series are we going to do next? And after putting about zero thought into it. Because really, I do what I want. Glitch. I've decided that it actually isn't any of the ones in here. We're gonna do the Thieves Guild line. Cause I feel like it. And plus, I really wanna be able to have access to fences. So I can steal things and you know, be awesome. I'm pretty good at being awesome. Or at least I try to be pretty good at being awesome, you know. What time's it? 7 to 9 a.m. Perfect time to do evil. 7 to 9 a.m. The Thieves Guild has made Black I have like the least stealthiest armor ever. Where is... There's this dude... That I'm supposed to talk to. Some fine goods from Morrowind. He was here. Yeah. Oh. Oh, we must have had to go down to him? Okay, whatever. Let's just follow this little thing and go for it. La la la. Sorry, this is like, you're going through like the little intricate ways. La la la. La la la. la, la, la. I. I don't think we were doing this. Why are you always acting like such a big baby? I've gotten us this far. Is someone there? Dang, it, that almost worked. Quick, ninja roll! Haha. <laughs> There's like no room, so I'm just gonna let you guys handle that. They're like, dude, I'm being attacked by a robot. I'm like, what? Yes, you are. Robots are the heights of awesomeness, by the way. Die, 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 die! Die. 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 I'm just like expecting to step on a hobo and just be like, oh, hello, hobo. I don't got any more black soul gems, so yeah. Increase the volume a little bit. Alright. I don't think it really makes a difference for you guys. It's kind of like something for me. Gotta be careful of that. Alright, let's keep moving. Shh, let's play some maze. Dang it, really? I remember trying to navigate through this place earlier. It was a pain. Going through 15 different ways. Uh, all I want to do is start the Thieves Guild. I want to join you guys. That's all I want. I keep like hitting F. Good day, friend. Keeping well. Oh, come on! Fine, I'll kill you. I mean, clearly you have like no purpose in life, considering that your name is literally. You are literally a low light. That is all you are, and that is all you will ever be. Because ah! you know, slamming someone point blank into a wall, that ain't, that ain't gonna. Why does everyone want to- Whoa! I thought that was someone else for a second. I was like, whoa! Can't believe I just dodged that. 
All you will ever be is a low life. You do not deserve mercy. Dang! La la la! La la la! Good day, friend. Stay out of trouble, or there's gonna be trouble. I'm surprised that no one has a problem with the fact that I'm down here. Got a lot of nerve coming down here. People tend to get hurt. Uh, do you know anything about Arundel? Only rumors. He used to have a home Shush. in Star. He required. Burned it down. Yeah. The people say he was doing unspeakable experiments on reanimation. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that guy. Made for Ingvild. I recovered all of Arundel's journals. As promised, here's your payment for bringing them to me. Got it as part of a fair trade from my client. Huh. Cool. Mm -hmm. Hey, I want to join you guys. Whatever you're selling, I'm not buying. Dang it. Uh, I swear there was. Uh... Hang on, I, I I'm. Stay here long if I, were here. Yeah. I may have to do a little digging. Huh. I suppose I can work with your face. Say what? After all, the sculptor cannot always choose the finest clay. Say what? I assumed you were here to see me about your face. To have it sculpted into something more artful than nature has bestowed upon you. Oh, your face so, changer. Oh, are you here as a client? Shall I remake your face? Oh. Indeed. It is no small thing to submit yourself to the flesh sculptor's knife. Freaky. I have no business with you. I'm surprised everyone like hasn't like attacked me yet. Like, dude, what are you doing here? I want to kill you. I'll be like, dang. Okay, I'm gonna try to make it. Ah, forget this. All right, I'm gonna make it back to the surface. And then figure out how to start that quest line. Because I swear, that guy just stands in the middle. And then you talk to him and he's like, You know what? I like you. How would you like to join the Thieves Guild? You seem to got some aptitude. And I'm like, yeah, I got some aptitude. And they're like, cool. Join the Thieves Guild. So give me a second. I'm going to figure that out. Because I don't want to deal with this. There's a giant rat. Okay, sorry. Back to work. There he is. Brynjolf? Never done an honest day's work in your life for all that coin you're carrying, hey lad? Uh, I mostly was adventuring for you're it. saying you've got the coin, but you didn't earn a septum of it honestly. Yeah, yeah I did, actually. I can tell. I'm adventuring, dang it. It's all about sizing up your mark, lad. What? The way they walk, what they're wearing. It's a dead giveaway. I'm wearing armor from a foreign land. Oh, but that's where you're wrong, lad. Wealth is my business. Hmm. Maybe you'd like a taste. What do you have in mind? I've got a bit of an errand to perform, but I need an extra pair of hands. I got a little robot. And in my <laughs> line of work, extra hands are well paid. All right. Simple. I'm going to cause a distraction. You're going to steal Medesi's silver ring from a strong box under a stand. Okay. Once you have it, I want you to place it in Branche's pocket without him noticing. Why plant the ring on Branche? Wants to see him put out of business permanently. That's all you need to know. I'm part of the Thieves Guild, so I accept this mission. Ready, and we'll get started. All right. A chance arrangement. I should write that down. Chance arrangement. I'm ready. Let's get this started. Good. Wait until I start the distraction. Then show me what you're made of. Alright, Medesi. city really gets I have something amazing to show you that demands your attention. Robot, stay still. Okay. Dun 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 This is a rare opportunity. I wouldn't. Put you to get left up. 
Can I put a spider in his pocket? I just got like this little sick imagination of him reaching into his pocket and there's like a giant spider. He's like, what a crap! How does one even put this in one's bucket? <laughs> hey, do you want a giant skull? Giant skull. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm sick. Okay, where's uh? Do you want do you want a beacon of the gods? All right, where's Medesi's ring? Sorry, I'm silly. Okay, Medesi's silver ring. Make it quick. Waste of time. You're a stranger. I knew I shouldn't have waited. Looks like I chose the right person for the job. So yeah, you must sign me go. I chose the right person for the job. You did. And so good you to say it twice. Your payment, just as I promised. The way things have been going around here, it's a relief that our plan went off without a hitch. This is like the wrong place to say that. Yeah. My organization's been having a run of bad luck, but I suppose that's just how it goes. But never mind that. You did the job, and you did it well. Best of all, there's more where that came from. If you think you can handle it. <laughs> no way it was wrong to do those things. I'm a terrible person. Let's put that to the test. Yeah. The group I represent has its home in the Ratway beneath Rifton, a tavern called the Ragged Flagon. Get there in one piece, and we'll see if you really got one. Ari was down there, actually. Completed. Sweet. Taking care of business every day. Taking care of business. I don't know. Buying and selling fine jewelry here. Yeah, I would steal stuff more, but since I don't have a fence yet, it's kind of hard to, you know. Oh, actually, want to see the fruits of your handiwork? Because I just noticed that as I, yeah, as I just quickly read the text. I right, come on, go, 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 go. Hey, hey, come on, come on, come on. Oh, I just realized something. What? I didn't close the sliding door. You might be able to see him get put out of business. I've never seen me all this upset about anything. The city really gets to her. I think, I think they beat me to it. Okay, talk. Greetings, honored friend. Could I interest you now? Fine jewelry, safe travels, land strider. Looks like I missed it. Oh well. Please, I need but a scepter. A scepter is all I ask. I remember once there was like. And one of the towns, there is this beggar that's actually like one of the best pickpocket teachers in the game. And it's kind of like, huh? Really? Beggar, pickpocketeer, makes sense. <laughs> it's like, all right, I'll take that. I'll take that. Drum. <laughs> Why are you carrying that drum in? I don't know. Drum a dum dum. <laughs> actually, if anything. These kind of missions. Okay, so right now, Lydia, I'm gonna do something really jerky, okay? I'm glad you're here with me, right but this is one of those quest lines that I need to be stealthy, so. I'm. It's time for us to part ways. I'm sorry, okay? I, I'm really sorry. You're staying with me, buddy. <laughs> you're gonna keep a flippin' robot with you and you're not gonna. Yep, okay. Yeah. It, it, I know I just said Lydia's gonna come back, but at the same time, it's kind of like, wait, hold on, I need to be stealthy for this. Lydia, please leave. Thank you. You'll be with you different it later on, though. Well, well. Color me impressed, and I brought my robot. I wasn't certain I'd ever see you again. Game here is easy. Reliable and headstrong. You're turning out to be quite the prize. So. Now that I've whetted your appetite, whetted at the market. Whetted, whetted. Deadbeats for me. What they do? We owe our organization some serious coin, and they've decided not to pay. Hmm. I want you to explain to them the error of their ways. Can you explain this organization is? Kirava, Percy Honeyhand, and Helga. Helga. Do this right, and I can promise you a permanent place in our organization. How about me handle it? Murder. Honestly. The debt is secondary here. What's more important is that you get the message across that we aren't to be ignored. A word of warning, though. I don't want any of them killed. Bad for business. I'm gonna rob him blind. 
Good. If you need any details on your marks, I'll be here. Now get going. Can do. I'll be here when you're done. I'll figure it out. I mean, I probably should talk to him and be like, hey, what each one of them do? Hey, is there any way I can, like, personally ruin their day or anything like that? But at the exact same time, I'm just kind of... Mm -hmm. I, I, I think I can figure out some good ways just to mess with their day. I went the complete wrong way. What was that? Ah, damn. Look, I don't want to deal with this. Come on, Rotom. Rotom. I, need, I really need to finalize your name. Rotor. Roto, Roto, Sparky. <laughs> it's like Rotor, Rotor, Sparky. And then there's this one guy going, Ah, oh, get you, rah, 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 rah. I'm like, I don't even care. Okay, look, buddy. I think you're awesome, but get out of the way. Okay, we're good. Hup. Sup? What do you want? Who's care of Mara? If you'll excuse me, I have other things to attend. Sup? Blessings of Mara upon you. Thank you. May you return to her benevolence. I don't have safety. any business with you, so get out of my face. Fine. A important deliveries to make. No time for chatting. Looking for work? I need some. I swear, like everyone here blessings. is angry. Why hi? Here for a room or something to drink? Show me some coin first. Uh. Come on. See us again. Where'd you meet her? I met her when I wandered into Rift in a few His eyes. I'm sorry. I've been smitten with her ever since. In fact, I'm thinking of asking her to marry me. Oh, really? Blackmarsh tradition dictates we present a potential. No, seriously, his eyes. Ring to represent our future bond. I already have the gold band. So this is gonna be really awkward. Flawless amethysts to complete the setting. I can find those for you. I was hoping you'd offer. I didn't think it was my place to ask such a favor of you. I thank you. Yeah. Do I have any? Oh, I have normal amethysts. So excuse me. I have other things to attend to. Okay, so. You want something or not? I have a message to you from Brynjolf. I already told that buffoon that I'm not paying you people a single coin. But why? Look around you. I'm barely keeping this rat hole together. The war seemed to that. Um... Brawl. Good, and take this little message back to your bosses. I'm not paying any of you a single septum. Ever! Now get out of my inn. <laughs> okay. Okay, 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 okay. We got a few options here. Get it A. Nah, I'm gonna have to brawl her. Wow, okay, I feel bad. I said get out. I'm not paying a single coin. Do I need a puncher or something? <sighs> what do you think you're doing? Let's try this again. I'm just like, eh, let's try this again. <laughs> Trying to think how okay, see if I was this. I said get out. If I was them, what I would do is I would steal everything from a room, anything that's even remotely considered valuable. What do you want? I know okay, real quick. In black I already have the gold band. I was hoping you'd offer. I didn't think it was my place to ask oh. such a favor of hey, you. Hey, here we are. I with the rumors going around about how poorly your guild's been doing, she's become much too bold. I'm not that foolish. The last thing I want is a war with your people. The hell are you convinced her to pay? I'm only telling you this because I care for her. Don't mistake this as acceptance for what you do. Kirava has some family at a farm just inside of Morrowind. If you mention you know about it, she might just listen to you. <laughs> just please don't harm anyone. I couldn't bear the thought. Nah, right, cool. If you'll excuse See, if I could, if I had the amethyst, I'd just kill him and said, you convince her. <laughs> Here for a room or something to drink? 
Show me some Wow, she has a lot of options. No, and I never will. Now get out of my inn. No. How could you possibly know about... Please, my family means too much to me. Don't hurt them. I won't hurt them, I just rob them blind. Very well. Here, take this back to Brynjolf and tell him he'll have no more trouble from me. Thank you. Have a nice day. My skin. Like, have a nice day. Hello, well. You're kind of terrible. Yeah, I get that way sometimes. Alright, who's the next person to talk to? Next is the landlord of a large tavern. Oh, crap. The Pond Prawn. Fucking class of name. Oh, hi. So, can I interest you in anything today? Uh, yeah, I have a message. What? Oh, it's one of you people. I'm trying to be nice. So Brynjolf doesn't even bother to show up himself anymore, eh? Look, we just need the money, okay? What's this message? I think you know what it is. You're gouging me for what little coin I make, and you can't even protect yourselves? Ridiculous. Look, I can protect my... Don't fool yourself. It's only a matter of time before you people are run out of Riften. Nah. Okay, so I've had enough of this. Likewise. Now I have a lot to do. So I'm afraid you'll just have to leave. Maybe I'm a customer. Hi. My husband Bercy will be the death of me. He spends too much time worrying about Riften and not enough about himself. This looks valuable. Dwarven almost. I'm sorry, you're going to have to leave. Tell Brynjolf he'll just have to make do without my coin. I'm sorry, you're going to have to leave. Tell Brynjolf he'll just have to make do without my coin. That didn't work. I'm sorry, you're going to have to leave. Fine, you know what? Tell Brynjolf he'll just have to make. If I had it, I'd pay. There's no need to do that. Just pay them, Bercy. I think I think the reason I'm thinking of attacking that is is because my memory says that um he tells you that he really loves that vase. I'm sorry, you're going to have to leave. Tell Brynjolf he'll just have to make. Please, I don't have anything to pay you with. Don't destroy my urn. Just pay them, Bercy. You don't even care. You're terrible. No. That urn was priceless. I, I can find like 50 of them. All right, I get it. I'll pay on time from now on. Just don't smash anything else. Here, take your gold and leave. Yeah, me next peace. time I'm going to ask about them just because I now it's like coming back to me. So I'm just like, oh, sorry There's about that. that. Someone's making a move to take the pawn prawn from us. I think he's being paranoid. I'll help you if I can. Listen, I'm a nice guy or I try to be. Right now, I'm just a thief. And as thieves go, I'm one of them. I've been looking for you. Oh. I've got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Sweet. Let's see here. Another note from your friend Rallis. Ah. I hope everything is alright. We'll do that. Looks like that's it. Sometime. Go. Not now, but sometime. If you're looking for a handout, do -do -do. Hello, goes bunkhouse. All right. This is my robot. <laughs> it's you. Please don't hurt me. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I have no idea who you are. I know who you are. You've been terrorizing the entire city. I have. Please, there's no need for that here. Message understood. Here, I even have the payment. Look, I got the message. What else did you want? Just leave me in peace. Get out. Rotom, what just happened? I have no idea, sir. I imagine Rotom talks in like... In like a glitchy, clunky, British accent. You know, like, it's like a British accent, but you can tell he's loose in a few parts and he's mechanical, so he's like, I am not entirely sure, sir. It appears that she is terrified of your presence, even though she doesn't really know who you are or what a corporation you're part of. That's a terrible British accent, little guy. Yeah, I know. My name's Sparky. 
can't have Clanky, because I know a guy whose last name is Clancy, so that'd be weird. So, I'm going to name you... Eh. Oh. That just happened. Hang on. Mm. Here's the button. I just... There we go. <laughs> Sorry about that. I just accidentally hit my eight power strip. My power strip with my foot. That to do. Hey, guess what I got? So, job's done, and you even brought the gold. Best of all, you did it clean. Whoa. Sorry about that. Dumping bodies and keeping the guards in can be expensive. Here's what they owe us. Well done. And it would seem I owe you something in return. Here you go. I think Can't wait, little robot. Quite useful. Cool. Deadly poison filter of health. Ah, interesting. Ah, mouse is acting weird. What's next, son? Judging from how well you've handled those shopkeepers, I'd say you've done more than simply prove yourself. We need people like you in our outfit. Robot! Rotor! Rotor! That's I'm calling you Sparky. <laughs> That's the spirit. Larceny's in your blood. Larceny! Telltale sign of a practice thief. Yeah, so so. I think you'll do more than just fit in around here. Dang it, Sparky! What's on your mind? We've run into a rough patch lately, but it's nothing to be concerned about. Okay, good, just check it. Uh. Tell you what, you keep making us coin, and I'll worry about everything else. Is that enough? Sure. Now, if there are no more questions, how about following me, and I'll show you what we're all about. All right. Taking care of business. Stinking Roto. Loud and clear. All right, real quick, I, because of the fact that I unplugged and replugged, I need to fix something small, so... Give me a second, I'll be right back. Alright, I'm back. Sorry about that. Alright. So, so Veckel, the, the man. Sorry, like, his, like, Veckel, the man. Who is he? The man! What does he do? Manly things. Like, what? The man. Stop it, man. I think it Ichigo, whatever your name is from Fairy Tale. You're not even from Fairy Tale, you're from, um. Blue Peg is this, I think. I don't know. I don't know anything. <laughs> Place a little down. They're liven up here, don't worry. What? Did you just. Yes. <laughs> oh, there you are. Don't let Sparky intimidate ya. He's just a robot. Sparky's like, I am a robot. <laughs> Come on, Sparky. If I could whistle, I would. So what's this area? This is like really dramatic. So Mercer, this is the one I was talking about. Our new recruit. Sparky. Sorry. Before we continue, I want to make one thing perfectly clear. If you play by the rules, you walk away rich. I like this. You break the rules and you lose your share. No debates, no discussions. You do what we say, when we say. Fine. Do I make myself clear? Yes, sir. The rules were thieves. What's the point of rules? Good. Then I think it's time we put your expertise to the test. Ah. Uh -huh. Wait a moment. You're not talking about Golden Ghoul, are you? Even our little Vex couldn't get in. You claim this recruit possesses an aptitude for our line of So let's give him the most so impossible work. job we can think Golden of. Golden Estate is critically important to one of our largest clients. Cool. However, the owner has yeah. suddenly decided to take matters into his own hands and shut us out. He needs to be taught a lesson. Ah, uh, okay. We all will provide you with the details. No, sir. Aren't you forgetting something? Oh yeah, there's an army that you have to kill. <laughs> Since Brynjolf assures me you'll be nothing but a benefit to us, then you're in. Welcome to the Thieves Guild. Well, that was easy. Welcome to the family lab. Who's <laughs> like? I'm expecting you to make us a lot of coin. So don't disappoint me. Yes, yeah, sir. Simple. Do as you're told and keep your blade clean. Mm -hmm. We can't turn a profit by killing. Finally, a not-killing mission. With Delvin, Mallory, and Vex. 
They know their way around this place, and they'll be able to kick some extra jobs your way. Ah. Right. Oh, and talk to Tonelia in the flagon. She'll set you up with your new armor. Okay. Tell me about the Golden Glow. Golden Glow Estate is a bee farm. Okay. They raise the wretched little things for honey. It's owned by some smart mouthed wood elf named Arangoth. Look at elf. We need you to teach him a lesson by burning down three of the estates. How many are there? Eight. I'll burn all seven. <laughs> There's like, how many are there? Eight. I'll burn down all ten. There's only eight. That house looks the like one. Is that you can't burn the whole place to the ground. Ah. The important client Mercer mentioned would be furious if you did. Okay. Makes sense. Hi. The last thing we want to be doing is crossing our clients. What should I do about Arangoth Maybe himself? He prefers that Arangoth remains alive. But if he tries to stop you from getting the job done, kill him. Oh. The guild has a lot riding on this. Don't make me look foolish by mucking it up. Okay. You watch yourself on that island. Those mercenaries don't take prisoners. Oh, we need to go back to, um, what's their faces? So, beehives, destroy them. I'm thinking we use fire magic. Simple as that. I mean, we just go. Woof. Come on, come on, little guy. Ah, come on. I need. Okay, for Pete's sake. You're awesome, but man, you get lazy. Yeah, you know, next time I'm getting a dog. Just to mess with you guys. All right, Tanelia. So you're the new recruit, huh? So I'm the new well, recruit. Looks like you and I are gonna have to get very well acquainted. I'm scared. I'm the fence down here. The fence! You come by anything you don't exactly own, and I'll pay you some coin for it. Minus a little slice for the guild, of course. Basically, she's saying our prices suck. I can also provide suck. a few supplies useful to our trade now and again. For a small fee. She also gives the uniform, right? Sure. How about I get Dirge to knock you over your head and dump you into the cistern? Oh. Look, I've been in this business a long time, and I've seen all types. You can play it tough, or you can play it smart. Whatever. At the end of the day, you'll find that all we care about down here is how much gold you can make us. Okay. Good. Then there isn't much more to say. Here's your armor. Just make sure you put it to good use. Okay. Sweet. Why don't you take a look at some of my merchandise and we'll see what kind of deal we can make. Okay. Stolen goods. Oh, no stone unturned. Yep. Now we can actually figure out that that weird stone. And now is actually a good time to stop. I mean, for a long time, we've been doing flipping. I should. Why do I keep saying flipping? I don't know. For a long time, we've been doing very large. Ex why was I gonna say expensive? I have no idea. We've been doing very large episodes, so I'm gonna try to tone that down a bit. Eh, I'll sell you these back for a profit. Yeah, but then I won't ever buy them from you again. Ooh. I feel distraught now that you suggest that. And what are other things that are stolen that I don't want? Yeah! Never make that noise again. Yeah! What did I just say? Alright, cool. All right, then. Now let's talk to Fix quick. Before we begin, I want to make two things perfectly clear. One. One. I'm the best infiltrator this rat hole of a guild's got. So if you think you're here to replace me, you're dead wrong. Okay. And two, you follow my lead and do exactly as I say. No questions, no excuses. Why is everyone here trying to do the tough, the tough Good. act? I'm just here to make some money. To get your feet wet, and I don't want to waste a lot of time talking about anything but business. Um. I'm not going to sugarcoat it for you. We're in a bad way down here. We steal things. Who knows? Old Delvin thinks it's some kind of curse. I think he's crazy. If you want my opinion, I'd say it's just plain old bad luck. So what can we, we do? Can get out there and start making a name for us again. Only Let's I can. No one else can, apparently. And while you're at it, make a little bit of coin on the side. Not a bad deal, eh? Let's see. Lock picking. Is this unusual gem worth anything? Well, since I've seen one of those, what you've got there is a stone of Baron Zaya. Baron Zaya. Not like that, it isn't. The stone was pried off of Baron Zaya's ceremonial crown by a thief. As part of this quest line, we'll tracks. complete this. This is one of those quests that's just like you go around doing whatever, and then you just notice these things, and you're just kind of like, oh, cool. And then before you know, you got like 24 of them. Most people keep them as a curiosity. 
Some Was of the it guild members have tried to locate them over the years, but they haven't been successful. Well, until now. Look, I only buy things I can turn around quickly for a profit. And no one wants these stones unless they have the whole set. Tell you what, if you find the rest of them, talk to me again. Otherwise, keep it. Maybe it'll bring you luck. Okay, cool. You think you're finished? I've got plenty more where that came from. I didn't take any. Ha <laughs> ha. Alright, um, so my new armor. Let's see, carrying capacity increased. Pickpocketing. Lock picking. Price are 10% better. I'm mostly doing this for looks. Because now I look like a boss. So I'm just like, I look like a boss. Why am I in here? It's like, everyone stop. I don't want to take that route out. That route out is terrible. Uh, oh yeah, it's this way. I hate going through those routeways. It's just, I just hate doing it. There's just irritating bosses and stuff. And you're like, I, I don't want to put up with this. Alright, actually, we'll just stop right here. Whoosh. See if I can do it. Whoosh. I still don't get that little silver light thing. I just don't get it, but it makes me happy at the same time. Sup? Hey, let's talk a sec. You're making waves around here. I like that. If you I didn't do anything. anything. You let me know. Up to no good, are we? Oh, nope, you can't teach I'll me. I'll teach you, but it'll cost you. <laughs> Alright, so, on the next episode, we're gonna figure out that mission that is keep going around the Thieves' Guild. So I'm just kinda like, do I need to talk to anyone? <laughs> yeah, I don't think so. Alright, so, see you then.